and now pa our parliament na a ho e de pa na no anajo e na parliament de letter ba monte e de directives e ne che say rules a e na no pwe so bia follow our parliament honum in fact na an wode and the potato to not suggest who police go for security very very tight. Baby, we hold my hand. They say, "Be more afar." Nina, no, I'm so much about a parliamentarian. So now, any speaker of parliament, I'm the boy more by. Now, um, and now, no, after the Americans can say, "Me say, I'm going to do parliament." Now, say, "End this for at the end of when the best show ma, I'm going to make a I'm going to pay ten. The court be kebiano, the be jatun because on any embrano. Now, court a casa. The boko, the koko do a china. Na man of the Somado, and this is for what Batina me may go da, man quite a rule. Sir, and this is for was our two force in Batina may go to noon on the right of Mr. Speaker. I'm gonna fight. I will leave quietly. The law is my weapon. I'm Papa and Nano Pomco Piano. Nessie, and this for Aqua Cotina, a majority side or it's a no one, and I for no markings, any end people, Manukuno. Almost a song, Kukaka, and then you move PD. Piano na NDC for a bo mutu to a way to two among them revol revolution. A more can say be brave. Now, after Sansa Zemway Nano and a speaker by a month for be brave, the more reaction about the speaker. I best suspend a parliament indefinitely. And having regards to the public interest and the exigencies of the state of affairs in parliament, I will proceed to. In accordance with standing orders 59, adjourn the house indefinitely. That is sine die. I want to quote standing orders 59.1. It says, the speaker may, in consultation with leadership, suspend a meeting of the house indefinitely or for a period determined by the speaker, having regard to the public interest and the exigencies of the state of affairs in the country. Honorable members, I have consulted leadership, and I am exercising my discretion to decide to suspend the meeting of the House indefinitely. The House is accordingly Agent Sine D. No, and a speaker of parliament, a buyer. No, buyer, a bit here, see, see, mono, nessa, a resource suspended a yes, certain because. Uh, it is a number a uh, war air uh, parliament, you know. It is a end to mean do a more mong to a or major mass into a suspended air uh, parliament indefinitely. Ah, uh, or no, ne time and all the back. I say. And then, Mumra Parliament, and I said, my Mumra Parliament. Honorable members, as you may recall, on Thursday, I informed the House, pursuant to Standing Order 18 of the Standing Orders of Parliament. On the occurrence of vacancies in the house in relation to four honorable members. Yesterday, I received a process from the Supreme Court, which is a ruling from the Supreme Court pursuant to an ex parte application 
directing Parliament to recognize and allow the four affected members of Parliament to duly represent their constituents and conduct full scope of duties of their offices as members of Parliament pending a final determination of a suit filed by Honorable Alexander Afeño Marke. By Article 102 of the Constitution, 1992, and Order 641 of the Standing Orders of Parliament, I note that we currently have a quorum to transact business, but not to take decisions. I want to read the said Article 102 of the Constitution. It reads, a quorum of Parliament, apart from the person presiding, shall be one third of all the members of Parliament. As presently constituted, the numbers definitely as far above one third of the members of Parliament. But by Article 104, the numbers are not sufficient for us to take decisions. And I'll quote Article 104. Article 1041 says, except as otherwise provided in this constitution, matters in parliament shall be determined by the votes of the majority of members present and voting with at least half of all the members of parliament present. Honorable members, we don't have at least half of all the members of parliament present. Consequently, in view of the current circumstances, the fact that there is a question on the composition and constitution of parliament, and having regard to the public interest, and the exigencies of the state of affairs in Parliament, I will proceed to, in accordance with Standing Orders 59, adjourn the House indefinitely. That is sine die. I want to quote Standing Orders 59.1. It says, the Speaker may, in consultation with leadership, suspend a meeting of the House indefinitely or for a period determined by the Speaker, having regard to the public interest and the exigencies of the state of affairs in the country. Honorable Members, I have consulted leadership and I am exercising my discretion to decide to suspend the meeting of the House indefinitely. The House is accordingly adjourned sine die. So after speaker and Semono, you who say Afana Marcus also the same to ya. Now, no Afana Marcus, but I say, I mean, fact, speaker, I take the right decision. And now, the Supreme Court ruling is on your several a year speaker, and the speaker, any media air court as a stance now. Now, no, and Afana Marcus, they better just say, um, I to force him or not, dear, was near this for no more say. And a year speaker of parliament, you know, and a car say, or more majority into no matter majority side, or into until say. Speaker of Parliament, every pronounce say or more than common minority seats you want on position on and on and on. It's up to him now. The peace of Parliament is in the hands of Mr. Speaker. He says he's going to make the announcement to the House that the Supreme Court has ruled and he has been said. Once that is done, uh, we await 
the decision of the minority. Uh, on the side of the minority leader, he said they are sitting where they are sitting because of the announcement of Mr. Speaker. So until they hear of another announcement, they aren't going to move. So uh, let's wait and see. Mr. Speaker also concluded that after formally announcing to the House uh, the communication he has received from the Supreme Court and other matters we want to put across, he's going to adjourn synergy for some consultation. I don't know what that consultation is about. But we avail ourselves to any call. Like he called us into a meeting. He respected me. And that is why we are we attended upon him. We are law abiding, like I said, and MPP will remain in our offices. So that is the whole reaction from a uh, parliament and uh, nanopa na amount for expertise and kahobe yiki digiti but a uh, wanyi yiki digiti anopano and people for um supporters in the big opium or honor man for we break and was some say in fact it is very very bad to say on the quack opium our home aha a dog on a tv chawajin a comment session